you've been to your local supermarket lately, you might have noticed higher prices all around, but specifically with eggs. Yes, egg prices are on the rise, and Cheddar's Natalia Rizak joins us live to walk us through the dramatic increase in our most common grocery go-to. That's right, Hannah. In November, an average carton of a dozen eggs might have cost you around $1, but now it's hovering around $2.95. Egg prices have virtually tripled since November and show no signs of slowing down. Here's what you need to know. First off, egg prices typically increase annually from late March to early April, thanks to the holiday seasons. However, this year, average weekly prices for large eggs jumped an astonishing 44% compared to last year, according to the USDA. Like most other goods, supply chain issues rooted in COVID deserve part of the blame. But the skyrocketing price of eggs is the result of a different virus. In January, wild bird hunters in the Carolinas warned of a new bird flu outbreak, according to NPR. The highly pathogenic bird flu virus, or H5N1, quickly spread and compromised a commercial turkey flock in Indiana in February. Now, 28 million birds in the United States have been affected, even forcing farmers to destroy them in an effort to stop the spread. Close to 23 million birds have died, marking this the worst bird flu outbreak since 2015. So this massive loss is translating directly to consumers. And it's not just eggs. Chicken breast tenders in a regular pack, for example, rose this week to $4.18 per pound, compared to where it was a year ago at around $2.99. Fortunately, there have been no human cases of the virus in the US, and the threat of humans contracting this bird flu remains very low. But for the near future, we're gonna deal with those higher prices. For how long? Well, experts say the warmer, drier weather could help greatly. As for the 2015 outbreak, well, that lasted roughly six months with an additional months needed for prices to bounce back to normal. All right, that was Cheddar's very own Natalia Rizak. Natalia, thank you.